Hello folks, uh, this is Kinky, I'm doing uh, Let's Play Army Man World at War, Part 16. Uh, this time we're tasked to take out two uh, heavy uh, anti-tank cannons, uh, artillery type guns uh, that are shooting the uh, green fleet. Uh, but let's take a moment here and look down here at the detail here. Uh, that's just to go along with uh, the previous video of just uh, if anybody wants to try to identify the beach that we're on or the uh, what they're trying to simulate, uh, go ahead and uh, give it a try and put a comment below about which which uh, World War Two beach that you think the uh, that this is taking place on. Uh, anyway, like I said, our uh, task here is to take out two artillery guns, and uh, basically we're just fighting our way to the top of the hill. And uh, pretty much this is lightly defended for whatever reason, the defense here is rather light. Which is kind of a good thing. Kind of gives a, gives me a little bit of a break, rather than getting owned by bazooka men and tanks for nonstop part video parts. But uh, uh, also, uh, there, there's something I wanted to mention before previously. Uh, as many of you notice, I've been uh, shooting the gun rather rather quick. And uh, that's uh, sort of a gameplay feature that will be changing between the uh, various World at War series games. Uh, some of the uh, infantry rifles are single action, which is what this is. And uh, some of them will be uh, semi-auto and some will be fully auto. Uh, so... Uh, just kind of take note on it. Uh, on it, uh, like I said, this one is a uh, single, this single auto, I mean single shot. So uh, I have to mash the uh, mash the fire button to uh, get it to fire quick. But that also helps me shoot bazookas and stuff quicker uh, compared to the uh, other games, which is why I was able to take out that tank so quick in the previous video. Anyway, we get our first time to play with some TNT. Nothing much really to talk about with TNT. That's an, uh, oh, and also uh, bad grenade throws. And, and as you can see here, this is why I don't like throwing hand grenades. Uh, I was intending to lob them over the fence, and they didn't. Anyway, as you notice, the uh, tan AI is a bit more active and uh, mobile. Still a little slow, but they're getting a little more responsive compared to how they were, and a little, little bit trickier. Uh, if I was playing on a hard difficulty, I don't know how much that affect the AI. But anyway, here's our first uh, artillery gun. Uh, just making sure that there's no any tan around, sneaking behind the cliff there. But uh, to use the TNT, all you have to do is just well equip t the TNT and then run like heck for uh, 10 seconds. Yeah, each uh, charge of TNT has a 10 second charge. Uh, Sarge's Heroes was nice enough to actually put a timer on the screen for you when you uh, planted your TNT so you can turn around and see the boom but uh, depending on which Army Man series it is normally it's about on average 10 seconds so now that we've knocked out the first gun and you notice there's another TNT right there And uh, evidently, the guy I shot was running to that position. 
So we'll just keep going and making our way to to the other artillery gun. Nothing, too, like I said, nothing really too fancy on this mission. It's kind of a good good break. And uh, there's a guy down below. Uh, I was hoping I could drop down, but uh, nope, can't drop. Uh, can't drop down. So we'll just take him out. And he's not dropping. It must be our pal, the dummy target. Yep, he's the he's a dummy target. Well, been a while since we've seen a dummy target. Let's go ahead and take a look at him. Now, uh, you, you notice I've been switching views. Oh, and this is a timed mission, by the way. Didn't know that until just that, until then, but. Anyway, you notice I've been changing views. This is another gameplay feature uh, that's various between the Army Man series. Sergeant's Heroes also has on and off with it, as well as World at War. Uh, the uh, zoomed-in mode is basically where you manually aim the gun itself, and you don't auto-aim. Uh, some of the Army Men focus a lot on the auto-aim feature. Some of them don't. Anyway, uh, we'll go ahead and plant another explosive charge. And back off. And then we'll go see the kaboom. Anyway, this is BK signing out. Uh, thank you.